Brazil. It's the knockout phase at stake. Of course, Brazil in the yellow. Roberto Carlos. Just caught sleeping by that very quick play. And here go the Danes again. Even coach said, having Schmeichel in the goal, we feel we start with a 1-0 lead. If that is the case, in a psychic sense, as Jorgensen got that goal, in a psychic sense, the Danes must feel they're up two goals right off the bat. You know, Bob, I said to you just outside today that I was hoping the Danes might get the early goal. Ahead of Rivaldo, settled by Roberto Carlos for that low liner on one hop. Peter Mulder to the far post, looking for Brian Lodge of Jorgensen running to cover. Giant Brazil. They've got more registered soccer players than Denmark has citizens. Rivaldo's ball. Roberto Carlos. Roberto Carlos looking to get back on that from Dunga. Touches it in and put away by Reaper. No spectacular individuals, but their commitment and their teamwork is really exemplary back there. Roberto Carlos. Schmeichel is there to put the pressure on. Jorgensen, or rather Brian Laudrup. That's a Jorgensen. <laughs> Brian Laudrup tries to cut it in. Style and experience. His third goal of this World Cup. And we may have a... Let's see what color it is as Gondor, the Egyptian official, shows the yellow. Gotta know better just when they're back into the game. They're clearly getting the Laudrup... Uh, getting Brian... Easily in the air by Aldair. Roberto Carlos volleys it high, but not out. It's with the match presented commercial free by MasterCard. Lifted down the left side. Roberto Carlos now chasing with Jorgensen. And the Danes will have it. Jorgensen, who's uh, got the job of looking after Roberto Carlos on those overlaps, and there you see it swept away. But Jorgensen, of course, because he does, Jorgensen does a lot of uh, Michael Radrup's running for him, if you uh, know what I mean. He's a uh, Michael. 16th minute. What action we've had so far. Already today, as we said earlier, France, if you missed it, France to the semifinal, which was the French goal coming in, so they've achieved that much. Touched on by Colding. Michael Laudrup, tough first touch, and Brazil eats it up. Holland and Argentina play tomorrow for the right to play the winner of this game. Roberto Carlos. Deft touch back on it against Helvig. Roberto Carlos oh. tackled, and let's see what color this will be. Well, that's what they worried about, the Danes. They worried about the speed down that side. Helvig and, and Jorgensen are supposed to try to do something with it. Of some pile, but the Danes are on it. Roberto Carlos, who has expressed some unhappiness with this official World Cup ball as Reaper in the air. Settled, and a foul against... We will have a decision tonight, either in 90 minutes, or in Golden Goal, or in PKs. Helvig. And a throw in for Denmark. They confused about who was marking whom when Chile pushed an extra player forward to support Casales and Zamorano. Field. Roberto Carlos tries to square it off. The Danes are on it. Junior Bayano walks out of there with the ball. Rivaldo now sends it wide. Ronaldo, Rivaldo, back to Ronaldo, and he's fouled, there we play on, Fair. with Nielsen clearing it out, touched by Brian Laudrup now, Jorgensen back to Brian Laudrup, he's got Muller coming down the middle against Roberto Carlos. ABC Sports Online brings you exclusive World Cup on for Brazil. Moeller chasing now for Rivaldo, his second of the World Cup, and for Ronaldo, Ronaldo, his second assist of the evening. But four yellow shirts and only one red shirt as Bebeto very safe. Early in summer, Michael Laundrup sends that ball down the wing. Boy, Brazil just all over this game right now. He's spreading the ball from wing to wing. Great dribbles, great passing. 
Well, that Danish goal was a wake-up call. Look at that skill as Rivaldo walked through a crowd. Michael Laudrup slips it wide. The cross out by a collision with Nielsen, and Heinz just sends it back. Of course, Brazil old hands at being this deep in old. Possibly playing in the Olympics yep. in the year 2000. He would truly be an overage player. But he will retire from Brazilian Nationals by Bobeto. And Schmeichel says, let's get it out of here. Jorgensen now. The Danes seeing more of the ball now. They scored first. Brazil has taken the lead 2-1. Laudrup. Jorgensen, Tecquerel oh, is there. All parts of the field, and it's opened them up and shown us what they can do. The 110-pound weakling there shoving over a 200-pound Dane on that replay. Now Roberto Carlos as Brazil. And it looked like that uh, was a busted play, if you will, in a way, because Brian Lauder looked like he was a bit surprised by that, as was Nielsen. Behind Roberto, and so the ball put through by Huff, but picked off by Roberto Carlos. least but he's going for it new ball and that it's not doing the things that he likes to see it do when he uh... three goals in the first 27 minutes look at that control by roberto carlos and then definitely out of his box occasions and has been responsible as a build-up to both of the goals huff holding tries to keep it in it comes to Elvig now with some space Helvig, number six. Smaller touches it on. Jorgensen edge of the box against Roberto Carlos. It's a goal kick. It's true, but I can't remember them uh, giving up a goal in the first half from the run of play. You are correct, sir. Collins with a penalty kick for Scotland in the 38th minute. Laudrup for Nielsen. Challenge in the box against Roberto Carlos. We play on. That ball is still in and flicked out by Roberto Carlos to Cafu. It's top of the arc. Roberto Carlos now. Rivaldo. Dunga. Flags up. Offside. Interesting to see what his attitude is. Is he going to attack more or try to stop some of those counterattacks? Holding, bending it in, looking for jumping. Who can... And Brazil with the lead and the ball. But the Danes will try and make them play, and indeed there the challenge, and Roberto Carlos has to come back for that. Top thing for Michael. Bar, it looks to be go for goal. Jorgensen. Misfire on the clearance. Laudrup, go! We are tied! Brian Laudrup! Go for goal it is, thanks to the bad mistake by Roberto Carlos right here. You see him trying to make a single kick, he misconnects, and this is a great chance, but how is that ever dispatched? Whoa! An absolute rocket into the roof of the net by Brian Laudrup. No chance for Taparel, and a terrible mistake on that attempted clearance, and they pay the price for that. 21 goals in his career for the Danish national side now. Yeah. Brian Laudrup holding against Duga. Dispatching it beautifully is another thing. And what a classic piece of finishing there by Brian Laudrup. Bebeto back on it. Top to on it. Long ball, Michael Laudrup. Jorgensen's there. He's got Colding behind him. Soren Colding, the right back. He's got Muller in the box. Goes Ooh. far post up. Gone from one against two to one against four. And even leaving Dunga for dead on that run into the box. At a certain point, as the scoreline remains free by National Car Rental. What a great game, Bob. We had hoped that the, the Brazil, we were twice before, and I think he's needed. Jorgensen looking for Moeller. A goal against this Danish side. Jorgensen. Jorgensen. Brian Laudrup now. Crosses in front, nobody home. The whistle as it was over the end line. I'll tell you about may have surpassed England Argentina as best match of the cup. Taps on the ropes twice. This could be it. And we're not done. 
Ronaldo. Now they close him down from behind. Oh, great ball. And a good ball to Roberto Carlos into the box. Touched and just wide by the defender. Substitution in the 64th minute. This young man, 20 years of age. Roberto Carlos corner kick to the six from behind. And a bad ball. Helvig pushing it ahead, but into touch. Danes took the early lead. Brazil came back with two. The Danes tied it. Now Brazil on top. Five goals. Rivaldo against Helvig. Look at that. Rivaldo now for the low cross. Roberto Carlos launching it into space. Well, there's the finish by Ronaldo. He's got Roberto Carlos right here. Danielson comes into the box now with Ronaldo. What will he do? Dunga runs up. He's called his host, the ABC News Magazine 2020, all tonight. Beginning at 8, 7 Central on ABC. Ball. Reaper made that play. Ebisan in a forest of yellow jerseys. You're it on a dime or a centime, you might say. Roberto Carlos with Danielson. Rivaldo's going to for the Italians who obviously thought that they could get further than this. Though, frankly, they never looked like a team that had found you. Big dollars at stake. A Danish player within, uh, shall we say, 25 million of those people. Now, Laudrup is, is it, Brian, and that would be... That would be it as Jorgensen. Player for Denmark. They play it short. Jorgensen's on it. Into the area. No problem. Helvig again settled at the 18. Push for Helvig to the spot and just wide. 29 minutes into what has evolved into, I believe, the best match we've seen in World Cup 98. Free kick here given. Yeah, they'll kick it. It, it was yep. a foul. Crucial thing for Brazil in the next stage if they continue to uh, hold on and win this match. And uh, regardless of who they meet in the next game. Danielson. Brazil tested to the max. And equal to it so far. That's offside. Now serve a lot of long balls high in the air forward and try to win it in the air. Like that one. Brian Laudrup. The flag was up, though. That play was offside. Zé Roberto shrugs off the defense. Roberto Carlos put out by Topting. Settled, though, as we approach stoppage time. Johansson, Brian Laudrup. We are into stoppage time now. Brian Laudrup. For in front, put away. Corner kick. kick three. Have the organization and the heart and the soul. They believe they can draw this match at us. Roberto Carlos puts it in.